So today we're in the stationary section and we're looking for binder clips. So we got our nice high quality binder clips. As you can see, there's 10 in a pack. So really you only need one. So if you have 10 drumming friends, then you can all pitch in 10 cents if you're that cheap and get a binder clip. So this style of stick bag can be kind of annoying because the, the bags, they don't really stay open that well, but a binder clip will help that. So now your stick bag will stay nice and open and it can make really easy stick changes. So there's actually one other use for a binder clip and this actually comes from a big inspiration of mine, Bob Gatson. So you might have heard about this before, but depending on what type of bass drum mic you use, whether you use one of those Kelly shoe things, the internally mounted bass drum mic mount things, or if you use a Shure uh, Beta 91, I think, one of those like flat panel mics that you like set on a pillow inside of your bass drum. Now, if you use one of these mics, then most likely the cable is gonna rest on the head because of the porthole, and you actually lose quite a bit of low end because of this. So really, you wanna have the cable not on the head. And to fix that, all you need is a binder clip and now this, this isn't attached to anything because I use an Audix D6, so I use a little stand outside. But all you gotta do is clip the cable onto the bass drum hoop, like so. And like I said, there's not anything attached to this other end, so it's kind of goofy. But you can position it so that it's not touching the porthole. So I've actually talked about this trick before in a separate video, so if you've heard me say this already, then I'm sorry, but I saw these at the dollar store and I had to make an episode about it just to, you know, have an episode, <laughs> so it was either this or nothing, so deal with it, and if you hate me, I understand. So this concludes episode 3 of the Dollar Tree Drummer. If you like what you see, I suggest you check out the rest of the episodes. And if this is your first time here, I really hope you subscribe. But yeah, that's it for this one. I will see you in episode 4.